How's it going YouTube? I just want to show you a little trick that I've been using for the past year or so with great success for my Facebook advertising. And what that trick is, is scraping Instagram for emails. Now if you, if you advertise on Facebook, which I'm assuming you are, if you're watching my video, you know that lookalike audiences work the best hands down compared to any other type of targeting within Facebook ads. Now what we want to do with this Instagram uh, email scraping is scrape emails based on keywords that we know our target person or our target audience would use within their profile. So without any further ado, let's get into the video. Jumping right into it, the first thing that I need to explain to you is this search, search query that I'm going to use within Google. Now if you're familiar with search operators, then this probably makes a lot of sense to you. But if you're not familiar, then this is probably really confusing to you. So all this is doing is it's, it's searching for any instance of these keywords at gmail.com, at yahoo.com, at ymail.com, and so on and so on. Now, what we're, the site we're going to search is at the very end, siteinstagram.com. So this is going to search instagram.com for any instance of these individual um, characters. So at iCloud.com, at Mail.com, at Zoho. And I chose these emails because these are the most popular. So let's copy this and we're going to paste this into Google and search that. And you're going to see right away there's 8,230,000 results. That's a lot. It's too many. So what we need to do is we need to niche down. We need to find the person you're trying to target within Facebook. So for instance, if you're trying to target you know, CrossFit trainers, we're going to type in CrossFit trainer here, and you're going to see 7,610 results are returned. Now, with this knowledge, what we're going to do next, because I don't know about you, but I'm not going to sit here click into each page and copy paste all these emails. I mean, that, that, would take, that would take way too long. So what we're gonna do is, is we're gonna utilize a program called Scrapebox. So I've kind of already set it up. I have copied my, my query and I've pasted it into this field here and then I've given, given it three keywords. Personal trainer, fitness coach, CrossFit trainer. Because if you're targeting the fitness niche, you know these are these are going to be your bread and butter. So you, that's the first thing you do is you paste your search operator, you type in your keywords that you want to do, and if you have proxies, you want to load those up here. Then once you've loaded your proxies, all you got to do is click Start Harvesting, and then click Start, and you're going to see this progress bar. And my computer's slowing down for what reason, I don't know. But eventually this is gonna start and it's gonna give us a lot of results. So that took a little bit of time. I'm not sure what happened with my computer, but it was hanging for a second. So I just cut out all the time it was hanging and th these are the results that we got from Google. So we're just gonna go back. We're gonna click close. And now you can see all the URLs that we're working with. We have 1,016 URLs where Google found an instance of gmail.com or Yahoo, all that, all that good stuff. So now we click grab check. We click grab emails by crawling sites. And what that's going to do is it's going to look at this list of URLs and it's going to find all the emails within that page. So click, click it user agent I mean you really don't need to mess with that choose whichever one you want it doesn't matter and then just click start and it'll do its thing and you're gonna see emails are gonna start being found and it's saying it's telling you right here these are all the emails that we're grabbing right now and I'll let this finish up and I'll jump back in the video okay so the scrape is completed and as you can see we've We've captured 1,003 emails. This has taken me, what, all of two or three minutes? So it automatically saves the file. We're gonna open that up. 
and here you go. Here's a list of 1,003 emails that we can target within Facebook. And now the next step is to take these emails and load them into Facebook and create your own custom audience. And you know, you start targeting them via, via Facebook. I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, reach out. Thank you.